So to everyone who normally watches my channel, I just have to say that I normally talk about Nintendo Switch games and all that. It's more normally I talk about software, but today I wanted to focus more on hardware because I do like talking about hardware. And with what's been going on recently, I feel like I should shed some light on something that nobody has talked about yet. So if you are subscribed to my channel or just watch my videos solely because I talk about software, you may want to leave this video before it actually starts. But for everyone else, I hope you enjoy the video, and let's get into this. So I'm just going to briefly cover the rumor that has been trending on the internet. And if you don't know what's been going on, basically, recently, a relatively infamous Nintendo leaker I have talked about on this channel before, called Marcus Selvers, has recently been talking about another Nintendo Switch-related leak. This time, though, it has to do with a new Nintendo Switch console that would play games in 4K. I'm not going to go too in-depth on what this is. I'll have a link to an article by express.co.uk in the description, but I just want to quickly summarize my feelings on that. I do think that we could see a new console, a new Nintendo Switch console that could, could have better specs and could possibly play games at a higher resolution, but I don't think 2019 is realistic. Marcus Sellers says that possibly 2019, I think that's just way too early. I just, for Nintendo, when they do do mid, mid console refreshes like they did with the 3DS, it's usually well into the console's lifespan and that 2019 would only be two years after the, the actual system launched. I would say 2020 would be the very earliest, but being honest, 2021, 2022 seems more realistic. But even though I don't think it's coming relatively soon, like I said, I do think that we could maybe see something in the future. And when I thought about this topic, I remembered something that was announced today, and that was NVIDIA's new Turing graphics. Now, if you are not into graphics in general, the Nintendo Switch uses a chip from NVIDIA to this basically the graphics chip to process all the games and all that it's basically the switch's cpu i don't remember exactly what it is called actually yes i do it's tegra and although it's a super chip and it can handle most games at around 720p to 1080p which is about the switch's sweet spot it can't go all the way up to 4k however recently nvidia has been working on turing graphics now today nvidia did announce new graphics cards for the pc that they're basically just going to be for playing games at 4K and really high resolutions and not something that you're going to see in the Switch. But it is possible that we could see that architecture may be implemented into a new Tegra chip or something like that. Although most likely I would say that it would probably be a completely different chip and it would probably just be a Turing based super chip that could possibly fit in the Switch. Now I'm not entirely into how super processors by NVIDIA work, I'm more into the graphics card side of things. However, I do think that it is possible to see the power of the Turing graphics cards somehow make their way into a super chip. And while it would take some time to implement that technology into a smaller chip that could fit inside a Nintendo Switch chassis, I still think that it is possible, and a, having a Turing chip in a Nintendo Switch Pro could possibly mean that we could play games at 4K. However, it really does depend on two things, if of course Nintendo, if they're ever going to make a Switch Pro, and assuming that they are, if Nvidia is up to the task of making a Turing Super Chip. But despite that, I hope you enjoyed this video, please leave your opinions on this in the comments. If you want to check out my social medias, I'll have them linked in the description. And as always, see you.